Names like Elon Musk and Jeff Bezos are well known all across the world. Ask anyone around you about richest man alive and great chances are they will get the answer right. Proceed to ask them about the world's wealthiest females and barely anyone would be able to answer the question without Google's help. Today we will list down the richest and the most influential women in the world and how they obtained their wealth and positions. Number 1 Francois Betancourt Myers and family. As of March 2021, with a net worth of 73.6 billion US dollars, Francois Betancourt Myers became the world's wealthiest female. She is number 11 on the list of the richest people all around the globe. The 68 year old French billionaire heiress is the only daughter of Lillian Betancourt, one of the principal shareholders of the world renowned cosmetic giant L'Oreal. Lillian Lillian's father founded L'Oreal and currently the Betancourt Myers family own 33% stake in the company which accounts for most of their assets. In 2020, the sales of the company were slightly affected due to the changes that were brought in people's lives as a result of COVID and quarantine. The $33.6 billion company's profits fell by 6% as people lost their appetite for makeup during the worldwide lockdown. Francois was raised to be a strict Catholic. She often writes Bible commentaries and spends her time working on Jewish Christian relations. The Betancourt Myers family was the target of several controversies over the years, especially surrounding their grandfather, Eugene Schuler. The founder of L'Oreal was put on trial for suspected association with the Nazi government. Recently, they once again made headlines with Francois's marriage to Jean-Pierre Myers, who is the grandson of a rabbi murdered at Auschwitz. Together, the couple have two children, Jean-Victor and Nicolas, whom they have raised as Jews. Number 2 Alice Walton With a net worth of $61.8 billion, the daughter of Sam Walnut is the heiress to the fortune of the world-renowned brand Walmart. According to Bloomberg's Billionaires Index, she is the 20th richest person and the second richest woman in the world, and owns shares worth $11 billion in Walmart sales. Since March 2020, she has gained $7.4 billion due to the rise in Walmart stocks as a result of the free delivery system introduced as a part of an Amazon Prime-like membership program. This new addition has allowed the retail giant to boost their online sales by a whopping 69%. Walton herself has worked as an equity analyst and money manager for First Commerce Cooperation and was the first person to chair the Northwest Arkansas Council. She has also been the chairwoman and CEO of The Llama Company, which she herself founded in the year 1988. Alice has been married twice, once to an investment banker in Louisiana and later to a contractor, but none of these marriages lasted long term. In April of 1959, she was a part of a fatal car accident where she struck and killed a 50-year-old woman in Arkansas. Many witnesses came forward stating that she was speeding at the time and appeared to be under the influence of alcohol, but no charges were filed against her. Number 3 Mackenzie Scott the third wealthiest woman and the 21st richest individual in the world is the former wife of Jeff Bezos, Amazon founder and chief executive. With a net worth of 57 billion US dollars, Mackenzie is not only an American businesswoman but also a renowned novelist. During the tough year of 2020, she became one of the biggest philanthropists of the pandemic, giving away more than 5.8 billion dollars to different non-profit organizations all across the US. She continued being an ally and has donated an additional $2.7 billion in 2021 to several charities associated with causes like racial equality, LGBTQ, and public health. Being an endorser to the Giving Pledge, she has vowed to give back at least half her wealth to making the world a better place for humans. Scott has played a huge role in helping Jeff Bezos build his Amazon empire. Not only 
was she one of Amazon's first employees, but she also drafted the company's name, business plan, and accounts. Although she dedicated most of her early life to her three children and Amazon, she also focused on her literary career. In 2005, she published her first novel, The Testing of Luther Albright, for which she was awarded the American Book Award in 2006. Number 4. Julia Cock Julia Margaret Flesher Cock is the wife of the deceased David Cock and is fourth wealthiest female in the world. She sits on the board of directors of Cock Industries, which is America's largest private company per revenue. Cock inherited most of her wealth after her husband passed away in 2019 and was included in the list of Forbes' 10 richest women in the world. With a net worth of $46.6 billion, she and her children own a 42% stick in the family business. Julia is known for her beauty, her fashion sense, and her ability to entertain. After graduating from University of Arkansas, she worked as a fashion designer for Nancy Reagan. She made her New York Society debut through the Met Gala in 1997 and was also the co-chairwoman of that year alongside Anna Winter and Patrick McCarthy. David and Julia met on a blind date in January of 1991. However, it wasn't until they met again at a party later that year that the couple started dating. It was in 1996 that the two tied the knot at David Cox in Meadow Lane, Southampton. The couple has been associated with several well-known institutions like the Lincoln Center, the Metropolitan Museum of Art, and Smithsonian Museum of Natural History. Julia is also a former member of the board of directors of the School of American Ballet and is the reigning president of the David H. Cock Foundation. This charitable foundation has been long associated with causes like education, arts, science, and medical research, and has donated over $200 million to funding cancer research. Number 5. Miriam Adelson at the age of 75 and a substantial net worth of $38.2 billion, Miriam Adelson is an Israeli-American physician and the current publisher of a newspaper called Israeli Hayom. Born in Tel Aviv, Mandatory Palestine, she attended the Hebrew Realy School for 12 years. She earned a medical degree in Bachelors of Science in Microbiology and Genetics from the Hebrew University of Jerusalem and served as a medical officer in the army service at Nes Ziona. As of 2021, Miriam is the 44th richest individual, 5th richest female, and also the wealthiest Israeli in the world. A major chunk of her wealth comes from her ownership of Las Vegas Sands Corporation, an American casino and resort based in Paradise, Nevada. The company's resorts feature not just accommodations, but also gambling, entertainment, convention facilities, as well as restaurants and clubs. She now controls a 56% stake in this corporation, which was previously owned by her deceased husband, Sheldon Adelson. The year 2020 and the pandemic was a major blow for the company as worldwide lockdowns resulted in a loss of $985 million. Even though the casinos were reopened in June 2020, yet the business ended the year with a net deficit of $1.69 billion as as compared to $2.7 billion profit that was obtained the year before. The corporation has since changed direction and decided to focus more on their work in Asia as their business is much bigger in Macau. Both the Adelsons have made it well known that they are keen supporters of the former US President Donald Trump. Not only were they charitable to Trump's presidential campaign and inauguration, but also donated to his defense fund against the Mueller investigation. 